Some people right here in our area are preparing for Pope Francis's first visit to the U.S. NBC 15's Zach Nugent joins us live from Dane County Regional Airport, where Bishop Robert Morlino has begun his journey to see the Pope. Zach? Yeah, that's right, John Ali, Bishop Morlino of the Diocese of Madison. He will be taking off very shortly, heading to Washington, D.C., and tomorrow he has two events that he'll be attending in the presence of Pope Francis. The first is a special meetings of the bishops, and the second is a special mass that will take place around 4 o'clock. And we were able to meet up with the bishop just within the last half hour, and he shared with us what he hopes the takeaway message will be from this very special U.S. visit by the pope. I hope that the Pope's visit will be an invitation to all of us to grow into that deepest, most joyful sort of humanity after the mind of Jesus. The theme for this visit is love. Uh, love is the mission. And uh, Pope Francis has put forth a year of mercy. And so what he's trying to do is bring people closer together, whereas previous papal visits and popes have been uh, much more hardline of what a lifestyle is for within Catholicism. Now, Bishop Marlino, he was able to attend events in Rome way back when Pope John Paul II was in the Vatican, and he also was able to meet with Pope Benedict. So this will be the third pope that he's actually had the opportunity to be in the presence of, and he says it is just a very exciting time. Now, no doubt many eyes will be looking at the East Coast as Pope Francis continues, begins and continues his tour of the U.S. And here in Madison on Thursday, there will actually be a special morning prayer service followed by a live stream of the Pope's address to Congress. Again, that will be Thursday at St. Paul University Catholic Center. Reporting live at Dane County Regional Airport, Zach Nugent, NBC 15 News.